Hey everybody, it's Dan from Dan's Collectibles. Hope everybody had a good week this past week. I uh, went to the bank last Tuesday, December 31st, and uh, went to two banks actually. One was my dump bank, and they didn't have anything good there. They had one half dollar. It was nothing worthwhile, so dumped all my coins there, and then went to another bank, went to my Buffalo Nickel Bank, and unfortunately I couldn't buy any rolls of coins, any boxes of coins, because the head teller was not working that day, and she was the only one that has the key to the vault. So, couldn't get in to buy any coins. So, I, um, they did tell me, though, that one of the tellers who wasn't working that day was holding on to a whole bunch of half dollars and dollar coins for me, the large dollar coins. And she said they said they won't, she won't be until Friday, so I'd have to come back Friday if I want to pick those up. But they said they were looking at the coins, and they were really, really, really old. And I was like, wow, okay. So, you know, all right, so I come back on Friday. So for three days, I was running around just thinking like, wow, that must sounds like it must be a collection dump or something. Maybe some really old silver half dollars and dollars. And So I get to the bank, and I uh, the woman was there that was working at that teller's window, and uh, she had them all locked up in a drawer, and she pulled these out for me. They were just loose. They weren't in any rolls, and I could see that these were Ikes. As you can see, I got a whole bunch. I got 24 Ike dollars, and I was thinking, gee, you know, Okay, and then I thought, well, maybe the half dollars would be old, and she starts pulling them out, and I can see from the sides that they really, I didn't see anything silver, but she was doing it kind of quick, she was counting them out, and, and I was like, oh, oh, well, but, you know, I always take whatever they put aside, because, you know, they're taking the time out of their day to keep keep an eye out for me, so I don't want to disappoint them and say, oh, thank you, but I don't want these, because then they'll stop doing that for me, so I always take them. I can always go to my dump bank and drop these off, which is what I'll do this week. But I got twenty-four dollars in Ike dollars, um, three nineteen seventy ones, three nineteen seventy-six, and eighteen of the seventy-twos. And surprisingly, only a few of them actually have a D on them. So, unfortunately, no silvers. That would have been nice. But and as for the half dollars, I did find one forty percent silver. Let's get some. It's kind of a little dirty or toning. I'm not sure what you want to call that, but that's a 67, which is cool. I don't get too many 1967s, so that was kind of fun. So it was uh, it was worth it to pick all that up, I think, to get all these 67s. I mean, just a 67. And everything else is from 71 up to 2001. No NIFCs. But what kills me is that, you know, these two ladies I was dealing with on Tuesday were like, wow, they're really, really, really old. If they think something from 1971 and 72 is, is old, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I got a good laugh out of that. And then the other thing I was thinking was, gee, maybe the other teller who was holding on to these knew what the old ones were and kept them. That's a possibility, too. But something tells me these people didn't know any better. So, anyway, glad to get these. It's fun to go through them. You know, I do have to check a couple of the uh, ones from the 70s, 73s and 74s for any double die errors, no, no FG errors, things like that. Um, I'm not really expecting much, but if I do find something like that, I'll bring those in on another time. But hey, thanks for watching. And if you like my video, please click like. And if you haven't done so already, please click the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified about my new and upcoming videos. Appreciate it. Feel free to leave a comment and forward it on to anyone you think might enjoy it. I would very much appreciate it. I'm trying to grow the channel. Any help I can get from you folks is greatly appreciated. Thanks for taking the time to watch this. I appreciate it.